What's going on, my wonderful plus ones? Today is hump day. It's the day that I like to reminisce on lessons learned um, from my nonna and my mom, my grandparents, and my parents. And today I'm going to be talking about love. Love and generosity. And they definitely go hand in hand because when you think about it, it's the love in your heart towards somebody that motivates you to be generous towards them. You can't really be generous without having love in your heart. Um, very difficult. Unless you're one of those showy, then it's not really sincere generosity. You're just like, oh, look what I did for this person. Like... When you see somebody that's like a millionaire and he goes up to a homeless dude and he gives him like a burger off the dollar menu, you ain't really, de- you ain't generous, dude. Like, no. did you buy him a house, a little apartment? Did you get him in a car? No. You ain't generous, though. But you're a millionaire. But that's why you got all that in your pocket. But anyway, get that tangent out. So today, yeah, definitely, um, Love and generosity, you know? And again, it's very difficult to be sincerely generous without having that love in your heart towards somebody. It could be because you've felt that struggle before and you don't like that uncozy feeling, so you want to try to make somebody else's life a little bit easier to deal with, whether it be for the moment or if you have the power to you know, make it different than, you know, hook them up with the job and then it's not just, you know, for the day. Um, so yeah, definitely lessons learned, man. Um, again, people who know my personal story, know I've been through a lot of pain when I was younger. Um, I mean, I know it's a matter, you know, it's life and only a matter of time before somebody experiences pain at some level, but, um, that's from a tender age, yeah, like six, been to a lot of crazy, rough things and the love that my nona had for me it showed me and my mom showed me really helped me to get through that and it really molded me to be the person that I'd like to be with you know being generous being kind being considerate all those lessons didn't come from me they came from nona and they came from my mom who not only did their best to apply what they learned from the Bible, but also just in, in their own hearts, in their blood. It's certain things in life is very difficult to teach somebody. It's like either you have it in your DNA or you don't. But if you could learn those things, your life, no matter how rough it'll be, you'll have more satisfaction in your life you'll have more connection genuine connection with people because of that love and you'll definitely I, I feel honestly is the best way to be popular is not oh you're good looking all right cool I mean that's nice to look at but then you know that beauty could fade or if your personality doesn't match then you're ugly anyway so um you could have nice clothes, you could have a nice whip, cool, nice, good for you, awesome. What really matters is that 808, man. And you guys are going to hear about that a little bit later. Um, 808 is a rhyme that I did, and that's pretty much about heart. Um, and that's what it is, that beauty, you know. So, I love you guys. If you're feeling the vibe, do me a favor. Click on a like, share, and subscribe. Let's spread that love. Have a great day.